This video serves as an overview and comparison of two different types of nozzle shutoffs commonly seen in the fire service, the ball valve and the slide valve. The ball valve has long stood as the primary means of controlling water flow in the fire service. Ball valves remain the most common type of shutoff available from all manufacturers. Several different types are available including the full round ball and the split ball which is offered in double cut and single cut types. Full round ball designs are preferred for smooth boards due to the fact that they do not have voids to create turbulence in the stream. This photo depicts a double cut ball in the closed position. The purpose of the cuts is to make the opening and closing action of the valve easier by capturing the water coming in under pressure and using it to help pop the valve open or closed. However, when fully open, this type of design creates void spaces in the waterway, creating turbulence which will affect the integrity of a solid stream. By comparison, the full round ball does not actively assist the operator in opening the valve, but does provide a smooth waterway with no void spaces. As shown here, the ball valve has a very simple action where opening the bale rotates the ball into the open position. The primary disadvantage of the ball valve is that it is designed to be operated in the fully open or fully closed position only. Positions other than fully open will produce a violent turbulence within the nozzle. This turbulence destroys straight and solid streams and will result in a surging, disrupted fog pattern as well. This photo clearly shows the effect of attempting to gate back a wall valve. The resulting turbulence creates a poor nozzle stream. The slide valve is an alternative design featured on many Task Force TIPS combination nozzles. The slide valve is designed to control flow without creating turbulence. The valve consists of a stainless steel slide that when open slides forward, pushing the baffle open to allow increasingly larger flows. This valve does not create turbulence when partially opened, allowing the nozzle operator to gate back as he or she sees fit while still providing good stream quality. The slide valve is typically combined with a detent bale that provides several different flow positions which are identified by an audible click. This design allows the nozzle operator to have the ultimate say over how much water is coming out of the nozzle. As seen in this photo, the slide valve provides for good stream quality even when the bale is not fully opened. This ability is useful during operations other than interior attacks, such as overhaul or small outside fires, where the nozzle operator may want to achieve less flow and lower nozzle reaction while still maintaining a good stream in order to penetrate deep into smoldering materials. The slide valve allows this to happen without having to adjust pressures at the pump. In review, the ball valve is the most common type of nozzle shutoff available from all manufacturers. Full round ball designs are the preferred type of shutoff for smooth wear nozzles. The slide valve is an alternative design found on many TFT combination nozzles. The slide valve allows for nozzle man flow control by allowing the bale to be gated back without creating stream turbulence. Knowing which type of nozzles in your hands and how they work will allow you to become a more effective nozzle operator.